do you do in your free time? Now let's take a look at this picture. This statistic published in Statista shows the most popular activity among adults in the United States. As can be seen, about 42% of respondents named watching television as their most preferred activity in the leisure time. Moreover, the rate of this activity is about twice to six times higher than the others apart from reading. So from this source, I could assume that the impact of media, especially the television as well as movies, on the whole society has been highly increased. Uh, so do you want to know more about the influence of watching television or movie on your behaviors? Let me show you. This activity contains both positive and negative effects. First one is about the perfect aspect. A majority of people will agree with me that watching television is the great way for entertainment. How can it affect our behaviors? Uh, when you have just watched an inspiration movie or a comedy, how do you feel? You will be more optimistic, you will be happier, and then you will have fewer or no arguments with the people around you. Another good point of this activity is that you can be smarter. Uh, as far as I know, watching tel uh, sorry, television contains a huge amount of information from around the world. So by watching television day by day, you can gain more knowledge. And from the things that you learn in television, you can put it in practice in realities. Um, as every garden has weeds, watching television also has a downside. First and foremost is about the sexual behaviors. The study published in Psychological Science said roughly 85% of movies released from 1950 to 2006 contain sexual contents. Uh, evidence suggests that adolescent sexual behaviors are more influenced by uh, movies than by the other types of media. So, can you guess why the teenagers are so into this type of movies? Uh, to me, it is mainly by the virtue of their curiosity. You know, they want to discover or explore more about their bodies and they want to get to know more about this type of movies. Um, so, finally, uh, sometimes watching television is also helpful for children. Um, you know, for them, a picture can paint a thousand words on their mind. This means when a kid sees a certain attitude on the screen, he or she will start to imitate this inclination immediately. For example, a little boy who usually watches uh, films contains violent sense. Uh, when he has an argument with his friend, he will fight them instead of reconciling with them in peace. So, as being parents, they need to recommend their children to see more and more inoffensive films or listen to more and more baby songs. From my own experience, to be honest, I used to be really, really addicted to watching TV. I could spend up to 5 hours in front of the television with some snacks or cocoa. But when I go outside, I approach to some of my friends and my neighbors. I realize that my life will become more and more valuable if I, um, if I do more outdoor activity rather than staying indoor in front of the television all day. So to put it in a nutshell, without a doubt, watching television is a brilliant activity in our free time. So, however, the people should be more and more aware of its side effects. Uh, so, from I hope that from my presentation, I will help you to know more about the effects of watching television on your behaviors, so that you cannot ruin your health and even destroy your life. My full name is Trần Thị Minh Thư. I'm a student in Lehigh High School. Thank you for listening to me.